Hi, I'm Juan with Dabs and Agenda. Today we are in Bulgaria and we are making this tabbouleh salad recipe. Mm -hmm. We are going to make a no carb tabbouleh salad. So we are not using any wheat and instead we're going to use cabbage. You can also use cauliflower. We have cabbage, tomato, parsley, green onions, uh, red onion or whatever other onion you, you have, lots of lemon juice, a little bit of salt and uh, olive oil. We'll start uh, chopping some cabbage. That's, that's good. I mean, if you have a bigger chopping board, that would be ideal, but I just use what I got. So. Here. So here we have roughly like three cups of uh, chopped cabbage and uh, to this we're gonna add half an onion. I'm gonna chop this onion. Put this in here. So here we got some green onions. I already like wash them and rinse them. I'm gonna put uh, one nice big one. Green onions. Okay, I found these incredible tomatoes in the market. Look at this. Much better than the first attempt. So, uh, super important ingredient for tabbouleh salad is uh, parsley. It's what it gives uh, tabbouleh that tabbouleh salad flavor, you know. So make sure you find like fresh uh, parsley in your supermarket or market before you attempt this project. Otherwise, better you do something else and also taste it. Because this one is really strong. Last time I I did my tabbouleh, I put too much, so better you taste it first and then you can always add some more later. And uh, I think when I use just this, this amount for now, I don't worry so much about this damn things. Right parsley, go in here. So gonna do is uh, add some good amounts of lemon juice right now so we're gonna add some salt to taste all this amount of cabbage and last we're gonna add some uh, olive oil releasing uh, its own juices because of the salt we put in there. See? Mm -hmm. So here's our tabbouleh salad. It's uh, low carb, it's vegan, it's uh, gluten free, has no sugar, so this will fit almost any diet that you want to try. <laughs>